Welcome everyone, thanks for coming to our session on customer service analytics. And I never know how to start these things, so I was kind of thinking to myself, what would be a good opening line? And I always hear people ask you, like, how was your conference so far? And then I realized this is literally the first session after the keynote, so I can't use that line, so I'm just gonna scratch that. But um, to kick us off here, um, just do a quick introduction. So I'm Greg, this is Sid. Um, we work in the customer service analytics organization at Verizon. And a little bit of background about me, um, I lead the advanced analytics team for Verizon. Uh, I spent six years as a data scientist, so really my background is in predictive modeling, or as people like to call it nowadays, machine learning. Um, I worked in the insurance, media, and CPG industry, and I have an academic background in physics and math. Uh, hobbies outside of work, I love traveling. Um, I love playing fetch with my dog, Daisy, who's actually really bad at fetch. And I enjoy tennis, bowling, ping pong, all the obscure sports. Hey everyone, it's, it's great to be back here to speak again at the Tableau conference and this year I'm hearing more than 18,000 attendees in Vegas, so that's, that's pretty wild. I'm Sid Dayama and I lead the data visualization team in customer service analytics in Verizon. For that, I was a first year employee at a startup which grew and merged to form WTA Networks. I led finance and analytics at the startup and it is then when I uh, truly uh, understood the power of big data. So we used a whole lot of data analytics strategies to hack growth, as they say in the startup world, which is essentially acquire users and increase engagement uh, on the apps that we build. So since then, I have decided to develop myself in data science analytics, and Tableau has been a loyal friend uh, in that sense. Um, my academic background is in finance, and I've uh, worked uh, um, at a couple of hedge funds uh, before too. With respect to hobbies, I have recently started to learn to fly, and I am steadfastly working towards getting my private pilot license, so fingers crossed. I'm pretty good at playing pool. I'm pretty good at playing uh, the sarod, which is a 25-string classical instrument. Kind of obscure choice to play an instrument, right? So people are like, what the hell is the sarod? <laughs> well, you'll have to Google it. Not now, though. <laughs> so, Greg, what are we going to talk about today? Enlighten us. All right, and he's being modest. He's, I've played him in pool. He's, he's, he's pretty good. Um, so go, uh, to go over the agenda for today, we're going to start with some high-level stuff, not as, as sexy as the visualizations, but we're going to give you an overview of who Verizon is, um, what our organization does, who we are, how we, we've set ourselves up for success. We're going to talk about a 5G use case, and we're going to talk a lot about speech analytics, which is really the heart, in my opinion, of customer service and how we, we analyze customer contacts into the business. We're then going to have a, a second part of the session, which is really our our, you know, our newest and most innovative visualizations, um, which is we're gonna have a strategic visualization, a tactical, and then, not even joking, a project that Sid refused to tell me about till about four days ago called Project Omicron, uh, which he's gonna share with you all today, which is more of like an innovative uh, project where we're trying to push the envelope 